The snow and ice have caused major issues all around the Portland metro area. We've been showing that to you for days now. Fox 12 Stephanie Domeral was out across Portland today and joins us now with a look at what she's seen. Hey, Steph. Hey, Nora. Yeah, we are in Beaverton now. We have been out across the Portland area today from downtown to East Portland to Gresham. And right now, of course, we are seeing some bits of relief. The weather is getting a bit warmer out here. The sun even came out a little while ago, we saw, and that's a welcome sight for many of us, and it brings the warmth. The light also helps to melt away a lot of the ice around our area. In Beaverton, here's a look from the air from our drone shot. Take a look at this winter, winter wonderland. Still a lot left from the snow and this in this storm in our area, but uh, beginning to thaw out a bit earlier this morning, though it was very icy. The roads were treacherous. We drove from downtown Portland to northeast Portland, as I mentioned, and it was one of the roughest drives we've had in years. There were down trees everywhere. Layers of ice and snow on the roads made it especially tough to get around by car or by foot. We spoke with one woman who had to be out to visit a relative in the hospital, and she says what we saw overnight was unlike anything she's seen before. It seems like a disaster. Yeah, and uh, I'm born and raised in Portland, so we've seen this only a couple times, but this is this is probably a record. Yeah, and she's right about that. Our meteorologists tell us this is the worst winter storm we have seen in at least 40 years. We are starting to see some relief, though, as far as the weather and conditions. The sun coming out just a bit in parts of our area, beginning to thaw out that heavy ice. In Gresham this morning, ice on the roads turned more to slush to give drivers a little more traction and make it a little easier to get around on the roads, though you do still want to be careful. And back here in Beaverton with a site overhead, uh, we are seeing some relief, though, a reminder that things do continue to remain. Uh, you do want to be able to be careful for a while as things begin to thaw. There is concern of ice dropping and branches coming down with them, so you do want to be careful if you're out walking about uh, just to not go under any big branches. Nora, back to you.